News at 9. I'm Sarah Allegre. But first on Fox tonight, Brownsboro passed an ordinance today making it the latest sanctuary city for the unborn. It's a movement that started in East Texas, and now nearly 40 cities in several states have adopted the measure. Fox 51's Katie Pratt was there for the decision and joins us in studio with the latest. Katie. Sarah, Brownsboro held a meeting at City Hall to discuss an ordinance that would outlaw abortion. The ACLU previously sued seven East Texas towns who passed similar measures. And that's a big concern for Brownsboro City Council. We wind up in a lawsuit. They filed a lawsuit against us because we did it, knowing that we ain't got the money to defend it and it'll bankrupt our city if we go into that, that lawsuit. Now, do not get me wrong, I am for this. I am pro this 100%. I don't want you to think I'm not. I'm looking at it for our taxpayers and our citizens here, protecting them and their money. Dixon travels from city to city trying to convince council members to make their town anti-abortion. You know, this, this wasn't the first city to consider this. Uh, 37 cities uh, have, have outlawed abortion now, and so uh, many of them have, have uh, gone through uh, this before. They have uh, wrestled with, you know, is this something that is going to cost our, our citizens, and they have all found that this is something that is worth doing. One resident who came out for the ruling today feels particularly passionate about the pro-life movement. Ng says he's able to impact lives at his school, Kingdom Life Academy, because his mom chose life. My mother had me out of wedlock. My mother was single and struggling, poor. She could have chosen to abort me. But because she didn't kill me, now I'm able to impact lives. Well, it's official. City Council ruled and abortion is outlawed here in Brownsboro, Texas. Well, today was amazing. Uh, we were actually witnessed Brownsboro City Council pass the um, ordinance to outlaw abortion. Dixon is on to the next town. I don't know what city is going to be next, but I do know that Brownsboro, Texas will most likely not be the last. The ordinance does not make an exception for people pregnant as a result of rape or incest. Katie Pratt, Fox 51 News.